So as you know, I did a quiz a few days ago, and I just went through the analytics, and I have the answers, and I am going to explain it. And also, I do not have a background gameplay, so I just have some random pictures of my art going on. Um, but from the uh, scores uh, right here, the average score was 57%, so that's roughly about 14 out of 25. And let's go over the answers right now. So for uh, the people who um, did it, most of it was from YouTube. There was some Discord and Reddit, and somebody had time to slip in a Your Mom joke before I remove the others. Um, so, so for the hardest gyms, generally, my audience is better at the game. So this is going to kind of affect the stuff. And for the age, this doesn't really mean a whole lot, but there you go. There's the number. So th for the first one, this definitely is going to leak a lot of lives, but 40 lives definitely isn't enough to get it down. So most of pe the people got this right. This one is a bit interesting because Obin's um, main attack will uh, seek. So it seeks up, and because there's enough space, reactor will kill the ceramics. So about one third of people got this right. This one is kind of interesting because the placement of the bramble doesn't really uh, kill a lot of the camos. So the crossbow is left to do it, and it just dies not a lot of people got this one right. This next one, level 8 Quincy, it does 3 times damage to the Moab. So this will actually win no lives lost, but I kind of removed this question, so it's just win. Most people got this right. This one definitely dies very bad because it's the wrong cross path boomerang. And a lot of people did not catch this, but it's still a good chunk of people got this right. And for this one, due to some hex timing, like I mentioned, you will beat this without losing any lives. And... Not a whole lot of people got this one right. It was a bit of a tricky one. This one also was a, kind of a weird question. Um, but this one definitely does not win. Uh, p Lord just kind of isn't good on Flooded Valley, which is strange. Um, so there's that. This one, also a lot of people got this wrong. The video uh, was from Artemis. Yeah, however you say that name, I'm not going to try to say it. <laughs> um, but this one actually dies because there's no uh, slow for the DDTs. A lot of people got this wrong. This one, it wins very, very easily because Dragon Breath is cracked. Um, half the people got this one right, which is kind of concerning. Um, and then this one wins because it's a level 9 Churchill. It's very high level. And with the Alk buff, he's going to take it down and you have way more than enough lives with like 200 spare most people got this one right now for this one surprisingly a lot of people got this one right too um outside of the loop will get slightly more pops than inside of the loop i was not expecting this actually um so a lot of people are good with the attack placements this one was one that i was expecting not a lot of people would get but it ended up surprising me and a uh, decent amount like 78 percent of people sit outside the loop that is surprising this one um it's pretty easy the back setup you uh, get to use your pierce better and you're shooting at the balloons instead of um at them uh 65 percent people got this right this one it's an alk question so this is basically like asking which tower is the best alk buff and you're gonna see that all of these die besides the middle one um so for the full auto one uh, it's just not a very good synergy, um, and then the one in the middle, it's going to hit both of those bouncing bullets, which is a very good synergy, the ALK works really, really well with them, and the other one just won't work because it's only hitting one, so, um, 68% of people got this right, very good, this one's another placement, it's kind of like the, um, one on Dark Castle, it's just like, uh, it uses the pierce well, and shoots into the balloons, not like trying to chase them by shooting at them. This one was kind of split, um, but the correct answer is the lower one. For this one, the uh, placement, it's the second one. Um, it's arguable that it could be another one, uh, but I, I decided to go with that, and a few other people agreed. Now, this one is really weird. Uh, a lot of people will get this wrong. You can only really get it right uh, if you play Muddy Puddles Chimps, but the correct answer is two. Um... Then this one, this is a really weird question. I probably should not have put this in because it's really misleading. Generally, the back placement would be better, but it's only the front placement is better in this situation because I'm using Glaive Lord. But like in a lot of other 
towers, like pretty much all other towers, the back placement would be better because it would allow the mob glue to spread things out. So now for this one, the uh, darts on the intersection will do better. This is kind of just like basic dart placements. A lot of people said on these straight lines, but this really doesn't do much good. And uh, all bunched together, they just miss a bunch of stuff. So about like a little more than half people got this one right. Now the next one, these ones are kind of easy. Um, will you be able to afford it? You, I've said this multiple times, but you make 28k from uh, 49 to 63. So obviously, then this one's like even easier. That one's just free. Um, this one, the sticky bomb, is better than the full auto. I only have uh, footage of the full auto, but the sticky bomb does win on this one. And a decent amount of people got this right. Um, 42 did not. So, this next one is also really easy. Generally, a lot of these ones towards the back are a lot easier than the uh, first ones, but Tac Zone just works a lot better than um, Super Glue, uh, especially with the Synergy. I mean, I mean, Super Brittle works a lot better. So yeah, that one should be pretty easy to get right. And we'll see how many people got this right. Good uh, majority of people got that one right this one is also super super easy of course uh, you have tons of mob damage why would you need more mob damage only seven percent seven percent of people got this wrong and then this one dies on round 60 just because there's not enough damage to take out the bfb so a lot of people got this one right too and then the last one is just free uh, grandmaster ninja socks so that's that was it um 315 people responded which really is a lot so thanks for doing it and i might do something like this if you guys really want me to but um that's pretty much all and bye